Yo, what's going on, 67 Leonard Squad? I'm going to try something new today. And uh, there's been a series recommended. I did I did that Kuzumbo game where I did the playing Kuzumbo until I lose. Um, and it got me thinking, what if... Well, it didn't get me thinking. I'm not going to lie to you. It got someone else thinking that... What if I made a series out of it? Like, what if there's a series about playing a god until I lose? And what if that series was called Till I Lose Tuesdays? Or Tilt, for short. And what if every Tuesday, instead of normal videos, I tilted? It's a pretty fun idea, to be honest with you. It's another long form video because I know you guys love the long form videos. Um, I know like one hour long video is better than two 30 minute videos for a lot of people. So, um, it got me thinking maybe I forgot my recipe. Maybe people would like to see it. So I'm going to try it. And uh, I'm going to try it with Persephone today. I'm fighting a Loki, which makes me think this will be a one game long video. <laughs> but you never know. I mean, maybe. <laughs> maybe it's a little more. I don't know. Who knows, dude? Who knows? Well, his clear is pretty good, right? Um, yeah, I'm kind of vibing. All right. I am definitely okay with this so far. I'm actually like really happy with it. He's going to hit level five here, which means he wants to murder me. And the reason I know he's going to hit level five is because... He got the XP camps on the red. <clears throat> but now I can fight back. Oh, close. Close. He's definitely coming back in. But I don't think he can kill me. I'm actually like pretty healthy. All right. No big deal to me. No big deal to me. I'm actually vibing right now. Can I just straight up get this red buff? Am I like that far ahead right now? Surely not. Okay, never mind. I am. That's pretty insane. I'm kind of vibing. Surviving the early game against a Loki is not easy to do, dude. Um, I do want to just max my two, I'm pretty sure. Maxing my two is good here. Uh, let's grab this and then I'll probably just go straight into some life steal or not life steal. I'm sorry. Some, uh, some defense. And I mean, let's be honest. I think I'm chilling, right? I should not have gotten, uh, what is that called? I should not have gotten beads. Is like, why do I need beads? You know, perfect. What do I need beads? Whenever he shows up, I'm just gonna alt. Dude, I'm vibing, I'm feeling really good. 
I guess beads are good for like if he catches me off guard. Like if I think I see a kill and I'm like, oh, okay, let's throw the alt. And then my alt doesn't kill and then he's like, all right, counter alt, bitch. Then I do need to beads it. Then I would understand why I got beads. So far, you literally don't scare me at all. Let's wait for this one to spawn. Oh, I didn't do it. Oh, well. I was getting XP camp. XP camp. Why is he playing so scared? I missed. Oh, Bozo Energy, dude. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I lived. What the fuck? Okay. Perfect. Oh man. Nice. What the hell? Wait, I'm like a Persephone main, dude. Hold on. Hold on. I'm slamming this guy. Um, this is going to look stupid, but I'm just going to go Mirrodin. And the reason it's going to look stupid is because Breastplate would literally overcap me by 10% cooldown now. So what if I just went like, what if I just went Amp Armor? I don't know. Oh, he just back. He just back. Nice. Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus. Oh, he like insta shelled, dude. He was scared. Oh, I'm actually pretty healthy because I can just spam my two. Dude, I am demolishing him. Actually demolishing. Perfect. Um. All right, now hear me out again. What if I just switched up my defense item and went mid guard? Like, what if I just have two tier two defense items and then some damage? That's got to work, right? Um, he's back. Oh, why didn't he back? Or, uh, why didn't he run away there? He just let me slap him in the face. He should have ulted. I guess I don't know if he had ult or not, but I assume he did. Alright, let's grab this. Uh, also, chat, I want you guys... Chat, I mean, YouTube comments. I want you guys to tell me what you guys think of this idea. 
if you think it's a good idea if you think it's a stupid idea uh if you think it's you know on and worth it oh Ah, he's running. To the wave. Not to the wave. Just away. I want you guys to tell me if you like the idea. If you think it's something you guys could have fun with. One extra long form video a week. Ah, it didn't do too much damage, I guess. I should back. I should back. Honestly? Like, how stupid would Soul Gem be? <laughs> It'd be pretty stupid. I'm already max cooldown. Um, I kind of want some lifesteal. Okay, what if I actually just finished my, my defensive item? Like, what if I just did that? If I just get, like, super Omega tanky. I still need Rod of Tahuti. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. All the way over there. Damn it, dude. I don't know. I do have Emp Armor. Oh, I bought Spectral, dude. Why did I get Spectral? I don't know. A little bit of poke. Maybe I just go Polly. I did not mean to jump into Phoenix. Alright. Um... And I can do a little bit of a little bit of damage. Hey, why are you running for me? Alright. I missed. Dude, why the fuck do I have Spectral though? Oh, oh I killed him too. I killed him too! <laughs> Alright, let's sell Spectral. Let's just go some damage, dude. Um, Obviously, Rod is good. I mean, I... I don't know. I low-key think I should just go Bancroft's. What if I go Bancroft's Rod? And just keep Midgard as my only defensive item? And maybe go Aegis? That's fine. That's fine. Hold on. I kind of want to exalt him. Ow. I hit my phone while I was turning my mouse and it ruined everything.
I mean, there's quite literally nothing for me to do here. I don't know. I don't know. Um, like he's just going to keep proxy clearing my wave and there's nothing I can do about it. minion dude that went straight through him i'm actually so dead i don't know how my one didn't hit him the damage Why do you have alt up right now? How did you have alt up? You have been slain, what the hell? I just need to How did he have his alt up, man? What's my alt cooldown? Really horrible? They have 40% cooldown. Because I had blue buff. Oh, man. GG, Phoenix. That sucks. That makes me sad. back get get the the poly that might help a little bit but probably not he does so much damage i mean a mage versus loki is just by the way the worst matchup in the game so like I have no idea where he is. I'm being so quiet because I want to hear his footsteps. Okay. He just showed up. Um... He's keeping his bow. I'm hitting some abilities. It's 
not like nothing's happening. Ow, man, you bitch. That's fine. I can just heal up. I can just heal up. <laughs> That's funny. What's that red buff? Let me get the red buff too. Oh. Just running. enough not quite enough damn let's go get a 3k pot um i feel like a 3k defense pot would actually be better than a damage pot i feel like i'm lacking on survivability more than i'm lacking on damage this is a very annoying game by the way fighting a loki Let's go, dude. The poly. The poly carried. The poly actually carried. Like, unironically. Um, I don't think I can kill this, but I might be able to do some decent damage to it. Um, I really don't want him to kill me. If I just stop his back, I win, right? I have no idea where he went. Okay. Never mind. I didn't realize I was dealing with Houdini. That's my bad. Let me go get my blue buff. And then, uh, I don't have Aegis, so I'm, I could, I could die in a fight, but I don't know. I 
I did hear him stealth just now. There we go. I think I killed myself. Did not kill myself. I probably got very close though. I could die here. Phoenix comes up very soon. <laughs> GG, baby. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. I just beat a Loki with Persephone. Bro, that should never happen. Let's actually go. That's insane. I'm insane. Holy crap. I'll see you guys in game two. Or I stay... Till I lose it. What up, boys? Game number two. Of Till I lose Tuesdays on Persephone. Um, It has come to my attention that I probably need to create a cap of time that I allow myself to play until I lose Tuesdays. Because if I pick like even a remotely decent God, isn't it just like, just over? Like, isn't it just over? Let's say I play Kronos until I lose Tuesday. I could literally play Kronos for the rest of eternity and not lose so like what if i had a cap and that cap was like two hours two or three hours i don't know two or three hours i don't know but i'm using a new skin by the way i'm gonna make sure that until i lose tuesdays if you guys like this idea if you don't like it by the way please mention it in the comments if you're like nah i don't really like the whole spamming one god till you lose series even if it's gonna be it's gonna be gods that i don't play often it'll be like it'll be shit like you know persephone and jingwei and fucking jormungandr you know like it'll be stuff i don't play often but um if you don't like the idea then please let me know and if you do love the idea please let me know i really need feedback in order to know what you guys want to see and uh if you like this kind of idea of content Because I'm driving blind, man. I'm driving blind here. I am in complete control. I used his two and his horn charge. Oh. Oh. But I don't think he's loving it. I don't know why he picked Kuzenbo. This is the Loki from last game. I think I might have killed his spirit a little bit. I feel like for a Loki player to go from fucking Loki to Kuzenbo, it's got to be like, it's a spirit ender for sure. Well, my one goes through Nene. That's good to know. All right, I've spent all of the necessary amount of mana for my bow. Now I just need to do some player damage.
<clears throat> I took way more damage than I was supposed to. Then Nene actually beat the shit out of me. Your middle tower's under attack. That's okay. I'm chilling. I feel like I'll never be able to. Um, why am I maxing my one instead of my two? By the way, that's an error. I'll never be able to alt him, so I'll probably just end up alting for for funsies this game. A little for fun alting. I'm also gonna go Bancroft's next item instead of Genji's. Although I will say Genji's probably is like really really good for me. Because Genji's Mirrodin is 40% cooldown. And also, you get a ton of MP5. So it's probably pretty good. Oh. Getting your Nene. I can just kill you, right? Oh, he has beads. He has beads and alt. I didn't know he was going double CC immunity. Damn. My dude wants to be immune immune. All right, let's go Bancroft. My minions and I grow even stronger. Just going to go mana pots. Like mana pot and... Uh, a multipot because I am running out of mana so fast. My gold is doing decent. He's got more XP than me though, right? He does not have more XP than me. He is so tanky, dude. Get some healing from those little beautiful little uh, flower things. Man, I tried jumping so many times and it just like never worked. Wait, why are you backing? Like I get you got the red, but you're going to lose so much XP and gold for the red buff. That was super not worth it. Might need to be. No, I'm kidding. Dude, I'm straight healing. I'm straight healing. I don't even got Bancrofts yet. Now let's see. XP camps up. Ooh. The juice. I mean, don't you just die in there? Wait, hold on. I had no mana. <laughs> that was that's. It seemed like BM that I kept him there at one HP. Genuinely though, I just didn't have the mana to kill him. <laughs> Oops. Oops. I swear. I swear. No, not BM. No BM. I promise. Right, let's go Mirrodin. I do need to go uh, Genji's at some point, but if I, I'll, I'll wait until I die one more time. When I die one more time, that's when I'll go defense. Or if I just start like getting fucking blasted in team fights. 
And by team fights, I mean 1v1 fights. <laughs> I don't know why my brain was like, team fights! Now, when I start getting blasted in, in fights, that's when I'll start going some defense. But I'm a thousand gold up. Like, I'm pretty, I'm pretty vibing. Pretty vibing right now. You know what I mean? Funk. 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 He beats. Honestly, fair. Get my minion in there, bro. Okay. My one full clears. That's really nice. Go get my mirror in. I should probably go divine. I miss. Oh. Bro, he's actually like really tanky. And all he has is tier two defense. Like he's he, he shouldn't be that tanky. That's fine. Let's just do some some wave clearing. And some Phoenix damaging. Oh. No. I'm dead. Never mind, I'm chilling. Nice. Alright, Mirrodin, and then Divine. And I guess some potions. I'll keep the Horn Shard for now. I, I could go Aegis maybe. But I don't really feel like I need it. I tanked the uh the nene so I could get some some Phoenix damage up in here. Oh. Oh. Genji just saved him this time. But just you wait. Away. We will grab that. We'll grab our divine. Extra power Honestly, you just buy that. Shoot. I don't know why you played Kuzumbo. I mean, Kuzumbo was good. Kuzumbo is actually pretty good. So I shouldn't be looking down on it as much as I am. Okay. I missed everything. Oh, he blinked and right when he blinked is when I jumped. That's actually just bad timing. Actually just unlucky timing. I want to get to the healing. Send that out. 
Oh, what the heck? I missed everything. I mean, this has got to be so annoying if you're him. Like, I would not blame him if he was very, very tilted right now. is max cooldown with my passive and all of those coins i am able to get rod this back it's gonna give me a ton of power my minions are even stronger. last item i don't really it's not really anything i want i guess i should just go typhons and get some pen because i only have 20 percent pen right now so i could go typhons finish out my my percent pen because he is a guardian after all they do have high base proc. Or I could just go poly like I did last game. Alright. Wasn't able to kill him there, but I did get his ult. Oh, what the heck? When is this Phoenix spawn? Not that soon. Out of here. I am dead here. Damn. Damn. I did say I was going to go the fence next time I died. Still don't know if I want to go defense yet. I'm just going to get increased cooldown. I'll go tier one defense for now, and then I'll go 500 pot. I could definitely have gone tier two defense because my passive and also the fact that um, I didn't have to upgrade my med all the way, but I don't know. I'll give it one more. He didn't even get my tower with that kill, you know? And I was really greedy during the fight. So maybe if I'm a little more cautious, we'll see how it goes. It does that blink? No, he lived. Are you kidding me? Nice. 
I got it. Gonna go over here. I am stronger than this. Crystals are we go. forever. Alright. I died again, so it's Genji's time. Might get my tower here. Oh no, he didn't. I died for Phoenix, by the way. I don't really know if that's worth it. It's probably not. But oh well, I don't care. Genji's is gonna do so much for me here. Don't know where he is. Oh, there he is. Mm. Oh. They feed on I mean, honestly, I'm kind of okay with that. I was just blinking his alt. I'm gonna just sit here and heal up. What the? He caught me. I can't believe he lived. I, I definitely could die here, actually. Nice. Let's go. Give me that. Oh, he surrendered. Fog. Okay, actually, actually a tough game at the end there. I don't think I said a single word for like the past four minutes, but I, but we ended up winning the game. Holy crap, that was terrifying. All right, I will see you guys in game number three of Tilt. What's up, boys? Welcome back. Welcome back. The game three of Persephone. It's pretty insane to me. This is my third game with Persephone in a row, and I haven't lost yet. And I beat a Loki. Like the Kuzabo, like hey, it was a little closer than it should have been, probably because of the fact that I uh you know didn't buy defense and also fed my brains out. But, uh, I'm fighting Eli again, but I don't know. Maybe, me as a great honor, although it won't be maybe it's completely fine. Sorry. I was thinking about the matchup between Ama. I think the matchup Ama versus Persephone is actually okay for me. I'm thinking of it in a way that like. If he silences me. Actually, I don't know, because he's CC immune in his ult. So if I alt and then he alts, I die. But if he alts and then I alt to counter it, it could potentially be decent for me. Also, if he invades my blue, am I not just completely screwed? Because my mana is terrible. I have to spend half of my mana pool. I have to spend half my mana pool 
Um, just to freaking clear the wave. Minions have spawned. So if I don't have blue, I'm just, I'm screwed. It's, I'm Scrooge McDuck. Let's fuck that one. Oh man. No. Fuck. I knew it would do that too, man. It's actually Jover. It's actually so Jover, dude. The reason I ran away is because I know what he wanted to do with there. What he wanted to do there was um, charge up his two and then dash me. Okay. Oh god, he's level five. I went to go try to steal that he would have just dashed me actually he probably still could dash me i think he still wants to dash me. i'm so scared i feel like i probably should be scared though i feel like i can die very easily and it's it's kind of terrifying I, I kind of kept up. Kind of. Like, I got one of the minis off red buff. And I'm getting the gold for the wave. Um, However. I don't really feel like it's enough. Did he get the XP camp or did he just do his blue? Just do his blue. Okay. I can just run this way. He already used his two. I'm not going to die. Okay. I did not want to go that way. Oh, you killed yourself. I mean, actually... Actually, isn't that better for me? Isn't that better that he gets first blood and I get the return kill? Because there's no there's no bonus to first blood and I get a 15% bounty for um, the extra kill. Like the return kill. So actually dying there and then... I mean, obviously if I didn't die and I killed him, that would be better. But like... Dying first and then killing him is pretty good for me. I think he's tilted. He's playing a little bit tilted right now. You're looking a little tilty. You're looking a little tilty. Oh, I caught him. I caught him. Oh my God. I think he's actually tilted. I think we win this game. I shouldn't, by the way, win the, be winning this game. Especially after he stole my blue. Like, I should be so far behind.
Dude, he can't play. He actually can't play. Have I been sleeping on Persephone this whole time and she's actually got here? Don't tell me. Don't tell me that. Is your blue up? It's not yet, but it will be in a second. And then... What's up, man? Thank you. Um, and then... Actually, I can steal this blue and then just jump over the wall, right? Like, I'll be fine doing that? Maybe? I didn't jump over the wall! Ah! No, 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 no! Oh, he ran. All right, cool. Ow. Oh, I missed. He used Horn Shard, though. So it's fine. Um. Oh. Shit. Dude, these fights are so stupid. Like, theoretically, he should be demolishing me. But then he's, like, missing the point. <laughs> I fucked up! That was a really good Aegis! Please stop! No, wait. Ran away. Okay. No way I want that. And Oh jeez. Oh Jesus. I have no mana. Damn it. Um, all right. I can go straight to Vine here, which is actually pretty good. I had so much gold in hand. Obviously, I was going to die there. Tower is under attack. I'm not going to do anything with it, though. I mean, he got the kill, but I don't think he gets anything else from it. Perfect. Stopping him is really important there because it gives me red buff. If I didn't stop him, then he probably could be back here already after his back. And he could maybe have... I mean, I, I guess he would have enough to steal it, maybe? To be honest, I don't really know. I poked him. What is this? I missed. You have a little bit of defense. Would I be able to kill him here, maybe? Oh, well played. <gasps> Not well played? Terribly played? Okay, hold on. Good damage. Still okay. 
Oh, okay. She's just gonna run away. That's fine. Uh, let's go Polly. I really did like the Polly play that I had in the first game against the Loki. I think it, it really worked well. How fucking dare you? You're just gonna die to me. All that did, all that taking my blue did was lose your tower and your blue. All it did was purely negative. Just because you had to be an ass, dude. Why'd you have to take my blue? Just, just go do your own. I'm gonna get the red buff too. Maybe, uh, you know, who knows? Maybe not. All right. That was definitely alt for alt. Alt for alt, but I get the red buff. I kind of want to go Gem of Iso. Because he's running a lot. And I mean, he should be running. Don't get me wrong. I'm not like roasting him. Saying, oh man, all you're doing is running. Like, he's playing Amaterasu. That's like 90% of Amaterasu's kit is being able to run away. But, um, I feel like there's not really a benefit to running away against Persephone. You kind of have to fight. And Gem of Iso lets me fight. Nice. Nice. I mean, he just cleared the wave, so like... That's unfortunately that, but... I got some decent damage on the Phoenix. And not... You know, not only did I get damage on the Phoenix, I get to get Perfected Rod as well. Which is pretty nice. Lower my cooldowns even more with some procs. And giving me some movement speed. Not bad. With per with with Chronos Pendant proc, Perfected Rod proc, and Bow. And then I might go Upgraded Med as my last Relic. Because I really feel like I don't need a Relic. Um, I, I kind of feel like I just won't have cooldowns. Okay. I mean, it did damage to him. I'll take it. Oh, man. All right, well, we did get his beads and his ult, I'm pretty sure. So I guess I'll take my win. It's insane that he actually got that red. I 
mean, this kind of stuff. I mean, honestly, actually. Oh god, wrong button. It doesn't even have that much health. I'm just gonna go Bancrofts. This looks quite dangerous. I'm just gonna go Bancrofts, then I'll start working on the med now. I want to do bull demon, but like, like, just cannot. Oh right, well, that's fine. I'm slowly pushing him. Like very slowly. Question is, do I actually get anything off that? I do, I do, I do. All right, now, follow up question can I just straight up win off of that? Probably not. <gasps> that is not where I was able to go. No, I fucked it. Actually, I'm fine. I'm fine. GG game three. GG game three. Him alting like that was actually the reason he lost that fight. I mean, he probably could have killed me. I don't think he would have gotten anything off of it because he has fire minions to deal with and as Persephone, something you can do when you die is you can control where the dual orb drops because you can run away in your passive and it drops where your passive drops. Not where you die, but where you die in your passive. So you can kind of avoid it. Anyways, I'll see you guys next game, I guess. What up, boys? I'm back and I'm still playing Persephone. Who would have thought? Let's go flower Persephone. Hercules? What the heck? What the heck? All right. I guess we'll play some Hercules. Sheep God X. He's got the GM dual border. I have a I have a season one masters border for dual, which is why it's so cool, man. I love it. Um. Let's go shell. I kind of want to go beads, but I don't know. Dude, I can't believe. I can't believe we're on game four already. Like, what the hell? Since when was Persephone good? Or since when was I good with Persephone? Or since when was either of them correct? Like, this is crazy. I don't play this god. Almost nobody plays this god. 
I don't have my hair up in a bun because I need my sides cut. I'm going to get them cut tomorrow, but um, it makes me very hot while my hair is down. Hello, are you here? No. Minions have spawned. You promise? You over here? Okay. That was actually really fast clear. I missed. Um, this is fine. I don't mind taking some hits. I don't mind taking some hits. You got a clear wave, bro. This shit is struggling. You're struggling right now. Struggle city population to him. Yo, that was so satisfying. I dropped my two where he was going to hit me, and then I shelled that he just... He just malfunctioned, dude. He didn't know what to do. I read his entire play. I knew he was going to punch me into the wall, and I... Not only did I live it, but I also killed him for doing it. That's crazy. Let's go clear wave. I gotta be honest with you guys. Um, I've been having a lot more success, clearly, with Persephone since somebody told me to max my two instead of my one. I didn't know that was a thing. I was like, your one hits the whole wave. Of course you max the one. Just kill him. Oh. Big survive. Big survive. Big survive. All right, let's go back. Let's go get that tier two breastplate. My beautiful blossoms need protecting. I almost have bow finished already, which is pretty insane. Why do I have my one on instant instead of default? I guess I probably played her before I played everything on instant. Hello. Wow, that did a lot of damage, actually. I faked going that way because I want him to walk over here and die. Or I'll just get your blue buff for free. Hello. Good juke. Um. Nice. Bro, I'm abusing this poor Hercules. I did not think that I was going to be able to do this. I thought, I thought for sure this was the match I lose. Like out of the two games that I thought I would lose, obviously Loki would be number one. And then Hercules would be number two on like the enemies I would lose to list. Hello. I 
I miss. Ow. Okay, actually, ouch. Can I get this red buff? I don't know how good my damage is here. Wow, I even I even kept one of my flowers down on accident and still was able to clear it that fast. Uh, let's go here and then... All, <laughs> I didn't mean to type in dick. I meant to type in divine. Let's get tier 2 divine. Come on. He's going Genji's. I'm actually surprised he didn't surrender. Because some of these fights have just been like dominant. Very dominant is the best way to describe them. Missed everything. Fuck. Oh, I just, I just get his tower, huh? Why is he trying to like cringe on me? Yeah, very close to messing that up. He doesn't have blinks. So I'm, I'm vibing. Do you think he follows me? No, he goes for wave. Good. Now we get my blue. We'll be back, we grab the vine, and then I guess we go rod. Oh, this wedding gift is absolutely amazing. And again, I'm still comfortable with the horn shard right now. I could be going med, but I can't fully upgrade it, so no point yet. Hello. Okay. He just juked the piss out of me like it was a casual Monday afternoon. And it's fucking Tuesday, man. Hello. I missed again. Oh. <laughs> he missed the boulder and died and surrendered. All right. I'll see you guys in game five then. Welcome back, boys. Another Persephone game. I mean, what is this game six or something? Like what the, why am I, why is there so many, why am I allowed to play this much Persephone? First off, nobody's banded against me, which is just lucky. Like, I feel like I fought the same people. Well, I fought Eli four times, right? Cause he was Loki, Kuzubo, Amaterasu. Maybe I only fought him three times. And I guess last game was Hercules. So this is game five, not six. I thought it was game six. I was wrong. It's only game five. Good stuff, though, dude. Good stuff, though, dude. Oh, 
Hold on. I'm texting someone. No, dude. Uh, sorry. I texted my brother. I asked him. I needed some help with something, and uh, I think he might have misunderstood. Hold on. That's not good. And that's not good. No. Maybe. Okay, maybe we can return it. Uh. That's okay. We'll get a bow. Okay. We're back. We're back. We're back. All right. Thank goodness he's not stealing my shit. I did outfarm him for for clear, which is honestly kind of expected. Oh, he went red. Well, okay then. Him going red is surprising. Oh, shit, I might die here. Wow, that was close. I'm playing a dangerous game. I should just back. I don't want to back. Oh, I'm going to die. But if you ult me, you're dead too. Ah, oh, shit. Well, turns out they didn't need to ult me because I guess I was just in range of his one. Unlucky. Come on, buy the item. Um. Makes sense, makes sense. But I'm so hungry. I woke up today and I walked three miles. So yesterday, yesterday we hit the gym. Um, when I woke up today, walked a few miles. Um, ow, holy fuck, that does a lot of damage. Alright, no big deal. I'm okay with that. I'm okay trading kills. Who has the bounty right now? Oh, there is no bounty right now. I have actually the same amount of gold as him, even though he's killed me an extra time. So I'm very okay with this. It's not like his one hitting me, dude. His one hits so hard.
Oh, he used his horn shard. He got a little scared that I was going to do it so quick. Alright, now you definitely got to back. Gross. I don't know... I mean, he's definitely not going to, like, invade me or anything, right? Right? Why am I so scared if I know he's not going to invade me? All right, we have our tier two alt, which by the way, you should level the alt because it does vine damage, increase slow and increase damage. I think this series, if you guys do want it to continue, I think it's good for two things. I think it helps me learn gods that I really dislike to a point where maybe I won't dislike them. Um, And then on top of that, Oh, I just altered you. I have no mana. Okay. Oh. It helps me learn gods that I dislike to a point where maybe I won't dislike them. And then on top of that, it makes me experiment with different things with gods. Like I'll learn so much more matchups and I have so much more knowledge about the game. And it's, it's very, like, obvious what gods I can play because I just straight up don't... I don't play them. Like, Yorm, never play him. Fucking Jingwei, hate her. Cherno, hate him. You know, like, there's... There's so much shit I could do. Why are you here? Nice. Nice. All right. Let's take some tower. I think I can clear wave too without dying here. We can just detonate and jump back. And that might clear. Oh, pretty much. Pretty much. And then I go finish divine. Which actually isn't that big of a deal. If he ults me, I might be okay because I can. Holy shit. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy. All right, he's getting red buff. He is not getting red buff. What are you doing if you're not doing red? the tower should be able to take it he did hurt my wave with his three but not to the point where i can't take a tower with it oh man oh hydras Oh, he's just backing. 
That's fine. We'll go rod now. I can't actually afford rod, but that's okay. I'll go rod and then I do have 800 gold right here. So I'm actually just going to go full med. The more I play this God, the easier she seems. Also, he's going bull demon. He wasn't going bull demon. He just left that wave for no reason. Nice. That meditation. That meditation makes me do an ability every time he auto attacks. Like, I'm just, I'm chucking him out, bro. I'm chucking him out. All right. Well, uh, I guess that was game five. Let's go on to game six. GG. GG. Uh, game six will probably be the last game. Because we're closing in on the two hour mark of not losing, which is insane. That's actually insane. What's up, boys? Welcome back to the last game of the Till I Lose Tuesday Persephone edition. I cannot believe that we have gone the full two hour mark. I mean, I don't know how long the video will be, to be honest with you. The video might not be two hours, but, uh, but I've recorded for two hours and 20 minutes and only one person has dodged a queue. So like, and the queues have been pretty quick. So I feel like there's not a whole lot to cut out for the, from the recording. So I, I think this is like a. Like a genuine two hour video, which is just insane. Two hours of Persephone. One of my most disliked gods in general. That's insane. That's actually insane. Well, imagine, dude, can I win this game? How many of these am I allowed down, by the way? I can have five and then six, six, seven. So I need to detonate one and then drop one. I need to detonate a flower and then press my two so that I can have five seeds and then three. That's the ideal. So detonate, drop, detonate all five. JK, I missed one because I'm poo poo caca. I can't believe that like Kuzenbo lost faster than Perception. That's heinous. Do we think this guy's going to come over here? All right. He's definitely not happy about that damage. Um, you do have beads. You went double chalice. What the? F no, no, he lived with one HP, man. Oh, that's so tragic. That is so tragic. It's okay, but like, damn it, man. <laughs> it was so close. It was so close. 
Oh man. All right, let's go get the XP camp. Actually, let's meet him in mid. Now let's get the XP camp. Oh, what the? Ow. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Hello. Jesus. That damage, man. Huh? This is crazy. You know what? You know what's the, the craziest thing about this video is? It's not the fact that I won six games in a row or seven games in a row with Persephone. And it's not even the fact that I'm playing Persephone. It's the fact that my perspective on Persephone as a bad god has changed. I think I was just bad at her. It's, it's crazy that, like, everything can change so fast, bro. My minions are taking tower at the three minute mark. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy tower. Hard to believe. You know, when you think about it, like I have 20,000 hours or even more in smite. And my perspective on a God can change in two hours. 20,000 hours of experience doesn't matter if I actually sit down and genuinely play and try my hardest on a god I don't like. It actually changes my perspective. Now, I'm sure this won't, like, work on every god I play, but... What the? How dare you? How dare you? He juked me. Get that Phoenix, boys. Okay. Like, look at how much damage I'm dealing, man. Oh, crazy. I am glad though, to be honest with you. I'm glad I did this. I will say it kind of numbs my brain. Like I'm sure my commentary was dog shit during this video because playing two hours of the same character is like, it's so monotonous. It's just because like, you don't expect to win the game for two hours in a row on a God you never play, probably. And if you do, then you're crazy. Okay. Hello. We got the minions coming. The boys showing up. Phoenix down. 
I miss everything because I'm focused. Like kind of bad, huh? Oh god! Oh, he has bees. Wait, he had bees this whole game. Why didn't he ever use it? My blue buff. And soul gem. That's not soul gem. And I guess rod. We're 30% cooldown. I could just go mirrored in last item. I probably should have gone mirrored in last item. I mean, that's just like. Not last item as in like six item, but like as in the, the previous item I bought last item. I probably should have just gone mirrored in. Would have given me more damage. Why is he doing XP camp? I mean, I guess I'm not pressuring him, so like, he has time to do them. If you really think about it, that's actually kind of a good play. Go, my flowers. It's so funny. <laughs> it's so funny <laughs> that he goes down. He goes down like into the depths of hell where wherever fucking Yada's portal leads you to. And he pops out and is still CC'd. That is so funny to me, man. Oh my god, we got an under nine minute legitimate win. Under nine minute legitimate win with persephone that's insane that is gonna be the video though oh, two hours two hours of persephone till i lose tuesday thank you guys so much for watching an insanely long video holy crap um let's just peep it right let's like one two three four five cs yeah, six games six games until i lose that's crazy um Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Seriously, please like, comment, and subscribe uh, because I need to know what you guys think about this video. So I would appreciate it. If you made it all the way to the end and you're listening to me talk right now, I want you to type two hour ain't no way. I'm going to give you a kiss. Saddam Hussein. <laughs>